hello um this video will help you to fully utilize microsoft word template the otx so how to do it um i want to uh, insert chapter one chapter two chapter three chapter four into one file and then uh combine it um uh, into template university d so what should I do? I um I want to use this template in CD. So how to use it? Just uh, double click on it. Yeah. If you double click on uh the template, Microsoft Word will give you Microsoft Word document. Yeah, there you are. Yeah, together with the simulation. So the name of the file is document one because I uh, double click on the template and you check on the developer. The name is uh, template in USTD. Yep. So I want to save this file. Save as. Save as on the desktop. Um, yeah, on the desktop. I have this simulation six where I put everything here. I give a name or reason my thesis this is this is draft yeah this is draft one yeah okay save so um in this uh template you already have uh the table of content from the materials on chapter 1, chapter 2, chapter 3, chapter 4 here so what you should do because you have to replace your individual chapter from this uh, uh, section what you should do is right click uh, did it right click uh, did it right click uh, did it right click did it yeah right click uh, delete everything yeah don't worry about this so now you see you have a notation here notation and you have session break session break will split uh, you will allow you to split uh, page uh, numbering from roman to uh, arabic so if the arabic number is uh, wrong here so what you should do is double click on it highlight and then page number format page number you see start at one yeah it's correct now and i believe uh, because of this session break the margin is not the same so what you should do is you have to learn or how to read the margin here so the margin is a uh, click on this page layout in this region the margin is this one 2.54 2.54 2.54 and 3.8 so i go my cursor i put my cursor here i said that i want to this i want to have this yeah the last one yeah there you are so um i want to insert right after the notation i want to insert my chapter one here so go to insert tab or uh, object text from file alright I go to simulation 6 uh, chapter 1 yeah I want to insert chapter 1 and I say insert there you are and then your cursor now is almost at the end of your chapter 1 so you should do is you have to give session break eh, to split chapter 1 and chapter 2 session break there you are your session break and you have this one and you can insert your chapter 2 insert text chapter 2 insert yep and you get your chapter 2 yep and again basically out break session break next page so insert uh, object text from file chapter 3 insert yeah 
and then again page layout break session break next page insert object text from file chapter 4 insert yep so now you have you have each uh, at each of the chapter you have um, references right you have references like this yep so what you should do is you have to give at the eyes at the last one at the last chapter you have to type references r e f e r e m c s references a uh, home on the style tab give this yep give these references i think you can use this yep oh wait yep use this one yeah so you will see the references would appear on this side so go to the references of chapter 3 yep and delete yep delete this one delete. go to references chapter 2 delete go to references chapter 1 uh, delete yeah delete yep and then and then go down on the references if you use and not you can use update citation okay so numbered yep yeah so they will combine everything into one here on the last uh, section of your chapter uh, four so how to manage your TOC if you go to the table of content so the content here is not the one from uh, what you inserted just now so what you should do is just right click and update field yeah so you will get the new one and from the list of table right click update field entire table yeah okay from the list of figures right click update field oh um maybe you can do this one yeah control a right click update field entire table entire table entire table yep and go to the content yeah the content is the one that we have uh just now and your list of figures right click update field okay table yeah yeah okay go up to this here yeah okay so how to how to um manage this table of content if you don't want to have this you can remove yeah so i just show you how to remove it so how to remove it uh, go to references go to table of content and you say remove table of content yeah yeah gone so you don't have your table of content so you can insert table of content from the template and click ok yeah there you go so on table if you don't want to have this just delete this yeah delete this delete and you want to have the new one yeah how to do it insert table of figures uh, so you want to have list of table yeah so you say uh, uh, table yeah from the template and then click ok so they give you everything list of figures you don't want to have this for example just delete it right and then insert table of figures you use figure and then click ok 
so how to manage content yeah so first you have to know um how what what style um referring to this conventional opener as i mean as yeah you click on the page number okay click on page number i put my cursor on this thing so it is on toc1 if you want to modify it just say modify you don't want to have bold yeah and then click okay so it is not bold now it's regular one so see anything <coughs> it which is uh, under the toc1 will automatically uh, uh, use uh, the new uh, style yeah so look uh chemistry and pattern recognition a 1.1 i click on this it belongs to toc2 so if i say i want to modify to bold yeah and then press on this template and click okay so it's bold so everything uh which is uh using toc2 will have this style so how how do modify this yeah you 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 look at what you have at the top here yeah at the top here see so if you put your cursor on number one here it's not the same as when you put your cursor here so they are they are different it it, it will uh, guide us to what we can see here if you put, you put your cursor here your cursor here toc toc2 yeah so i say modify yep yeah? i say i want to modify modify format paragraph so first i say that i want to change text uh before i say zero okay zero and then click okay yep and then new document version template yep click okay so now you see the the, the, the number 1.1 1.2 is, is is moving uh, almost to the left so this is how you can uh, change or modify your template so look at 1.1.1 .1 click on number 2 it is on toc3 so if you want to change yeah so for example you want to change modify uh, format uh, paragraph i say i don't want to have 1.27 i want to have uh, zero as well yeah and then click ok yep and then click ok so so uh, uh, as a summary if you want to modify your toc you have to put your cursor on on the on the page number same goes to a uh, table of content yeah look if i put my cursor on number one so there will be yeah table of figures and you can modify say for this one format uh tabs <coughs> i want to add uh 14 right set okay so you get like this so um <clears throat> yeah um look uh, because of the um title is a click so just uh highlight this one and double click once again oh, okay home and you say you don't want to have a click you are done so that's all if you want to modify your TOC and your list of tables. Thank you.